This one deals with the lost son. Have you ever been lost? Have you ever gone to the store and didn't do what your parents told you? And you walked around the aisle and got lost? You ever done that? Did you feel scared? You thought what? Oh, the zoo. You were at the zoo? Your dad said, don't tell that story. Amen. Children will always say something that the parents go, oh, my God. <laughs> have any of you ever been lost? You have where? At Food for Less, my mom. <laughs> she, she told me to go get some food, so I went to go get some food outside. You went outside. She said go, go get food, so I walked across the parking lot to car. Well, let me ask you something, honey. You were in Food for Less. Where did you have to go to find food? Carl's Jr., oh. <laughs> so you wanted cooked food, huh? Yeah. Anybody else been lost? You were lost? Where were you lost? You got lost in the store with your mom. Oh, yeah. Did you cry? Oh, good for you. All right. <laughs> Let's talk about this young man who got lost, okay? Here goes. Jesus liked telling stories with special meanings, like the one about a loving father and his son. One day, the son said, give me my share of money. So the father gave his son what he wanted. The son took the money and traveled far, uh, far away. He was happy. He could do whatever he wanted but he wasted all the money and had to get a job feeding pigs. Mm. What am I doing, he asked. He thought, I'll go home. But what if the father had stopped loving him? The father saw his son coming and ran out to meet him. He hugged him and he kissed him. Then he said, let's have a party. Wow. Jesus said God is like the Father. He won't ever stop loving you. You see, God loves you more than you can imagine. He doesn't just love you this much. He loves you with everything. He loves you with everything. And there's nothing that you can do in life that would stop God from loving you. So, he tells us, the son had a party. You know why? The father threw a party for the son? Because he loved him. And because he was happy to see him. Because he thought his son had gotten really in trouble. But his son came home. Because his son knew that if no one loved him anymore in this world, he knew his papa would love him. So, boys and girls, make sure that you understand God loves you dearly, okay? And no matter what you do and have done, God will always make things work out for you, okay? Now, we're going to have a good time in our classes today, aren't we? And they're probably going to give you something sweet to eat in the class. I don't know, but I'm probably thinking that. And I want you to be good boys and girls. Go learn from your teachers. Learn all about God and about his love for you. Okay? Let's stand up on our feet. Everyone standing up. And God bless each and every one of you.